High school football is physical, and players know that when they put on the uniform. But sometimes unfortunate injuries happen. One Gregory Portland sophomore shows us that with motivation, nothing could keep him from returning. Just being with them on the field, you know, uh, practicing with them, making plays, celebrating with them. It means everything. All my journey, the support, it just means everything to be out there in that uniform again. Wildcats dream of the day when they get to play for Gregory Portland. But Ryder Harrison's first game of his sophomore season against Cal Allen was cut short on a big hit in the fourth quarter. Ball was intended for number 23. And well, that's Ryder Harrison. I immediately lost all my breath. I knew something was wrong. I've gotten the air knocked out of me before, so I knew something was wrong, so I just laid on the ground. I didn't try to get up. An ambulance sent Harrison, who suffered a punctured lung injury, to Driscoll Children's Hospital. The unknown was the scariest part of how long it was going to take him, when he was going to go, and, and then when they turn off the machine and the lung starts collapsing again, that's, that's kind of a re-scare part. Harrison spent eight days in the hospital. The day after he got in the hospital, he looked at the doctor and said, what do I need to do to get out? And he said, well, you got to walk. He goes, I'm walking today. The hardest part was watching the Battle of the Bridge game, GP against Carroll from the hospital. It was just one thing after another, but uh, the rider's a fighter in it, and that's a uh, that's kind of way it ended up. His brother Colton snagged an interception, almost a pick six, and Ryder made sure to let him know he should have scored. Football's important. I love the game too much, so I wanted to get back. I saw my team out there, and their their morale wasn't very high, so I I wanted to get back out there as soon as possible, and make a difference. Before he was released, you know, he wanted to be out here all the time and be around. We had to kind of slow him down and stuff, so. He's a good, good young man, works hard. Three and a half weeks later, Harrison started lifting weights. And less than a week after, he was catching passes. We would just go run routes, we'd, we'd lift if we could, you know, just everything we could to get back. In the past couple of days, I've gotten in a lot better shape because of my coaches and teammates pushing me and making me better. Six weeks after the injury, Ryder the fighter will run out of the tunnel once again, ready to face Brownsville Porter a Wildcats dream that needed a team to accomplish. Uh, thank you for all your support. It's helped a lot. You don't know how much it's helped.